So, Hilda, now you are there. Well, what? That's great. That's great. No, what, what we said we were just trying to do is it? Um, it's just almost continue the conversation, you know, that we'd started this afternoon. Um, and it's really just to get a sense of the experiences of being supervisor, but also that experience of yours in being supervised, you know, with, and just getting a little bit on the inside of how that was feeling and what you were feeling. Okay, so I would just start with something we were saying this afternoon about the nature of the influence that you felt that was having. Yeah. Um, and then I had to take it back until uh, it's almost 15 years ago when I did my master's and you were also my supervisor at the time. And um, now uh, it's the same feeling of being so much encouraged and uh, how can I say it? It's, I guess it's very much the feeling of just looking into your eyes just now. <laughs> um, because it's, it's really what you've been talking about, inclusion of space where I have always felt it was possible to explore my thoughts. Um, as a, uh, a supervisor, you were always asking these questions. What is it that you want to express? Do you remember? Yeah. Put away your writings and just tell me. Yes. What is it you really want to say? Yes, I remember that. <laughs> I, I, I can, uh, that uh, that I, I really do remember when you yeah. say it. Yeah. And that was so important to me because you kind of when you were writing, you can camouflage some of your thoughts. Or, but when you had me express it mm. so explicitly, it cleared my own thoughts about what I wanted to write. Mm. And so it was much more easy to put in a new writing. So, and it's been the same now with my PhD. It's not that many times you really talk. No. But you read stuff and you meet me with this wonderful, wonderful attitude. Of what I'm doing is important. Mm. And just by uh, affirming that, it makes me, uh, it motivates me so much, so so that it really gives energy to all that hard work. Yes, because it is a lot of hard work. <laughs> yeah. can, I, can I just ask that? Because as you express that, I can actually feel uh, the, the energy, okay? Because you're also being so vital in terms of how you are communicating. But I'm just not sure if, in terms of that idea of self-awareness, whether you see yourself in the way that Siegfried is actually talking about. Mm. Because as a supervisor, you know, if I just ask you, well, what are the qualities that you feel that you bring you know, into the relationship? How, how would you just think about those or describe them? Um, I think that uh, for me the main thing uh, is interest. I think uh, it really is uh, uh, a kind of, uh, I think it is a sincere interest because I can't, uh, I can't pretend an interest. It's not a kind of technique that I have. It, it must be, a, uh, I think, I think to, to, to do a good supervision. I would have to. It would have to be based on a real interest. And I really think, uh, you know, that your work is very important. I, I thought so in your master's degree, and I think now. Yeah. So, so, uh, uh, and therefore, I also find it. Um, I find it very important to to. Uh, the supervisor uh, that you come that you, to try to help that you really come out yeah. with what's what is the core in your interest yes and then um, it's within that interest that you go so it's your all of your experience um, all of your creativity that affirms and also guides you really want me to come out with mine, but you also have such a jealous and I think maybe the way you affirm things it feels like a very secure quality. Oh, how should I say that? Yeah, I, feel, I could actually understand that. Yeah, you could? Yeah, yeah really. But what I'm also feeling is how you're looking very serious. No, <laughs> no really. Yeah. Yeah. No, I, I, literally. 
as you speak, you know, this afternoon, there was that wonderful moment like this where, wasn't it? It was yeah. spontaneous, and your presence was yeah. one of pleasure. Yeah. Um, and that's what I'm feeling from you, that you felt yeah. your pleasure. So although you are talking about interest, and it is a sincere interest, <laughs> yeah, but it's being expressed so seriously. Yeah. And I'm feeling the secret. You actually felt this life and the vitality, and my language would be life enhancing energy. Absolutely. Yeah, that you were just experiencing then. You, yeah. Yeah, where the, the cognitive isn't getting in the way. No, I, I see yeah. exactly what you mean, and that was what I felt too. It, so it, I see exactly what you mean, because it's very different. Because then I just, you know, I just said what I thought about mm. the, his work. But now I feel a bit more like I'm talking about it. Yeah. You know. Yeah. And I think it's a bit hard to talk about my supervision because I, I, I it's something that I just do, you know. I just I just do it. Yes. And uh, the point is to be there. <laughs> yeah. And it's this yeah, but it's this very comfortable sense being in that situation. It's not like I'm scared to go to my supervisor. <laughs> but it is a, a very sure feeling of getting energized by it. Mm. See, what I think that I will be able to do is just to take a brief conversation we've just had. Another moment where your spontaneous humor was expressed, okay? I think I'll be able to point to that <laughs> and say, look, Sigrid, this is what I feel you would be experiencing with that pleasure and the energy which is you being fully present, so you're no longer having to think, think and come Yeah, together. that's exactly oh, that so, uh, the thing. And that's yeah. when the light really comes through in your eyes as well. Yes. <laughs> and we do have these moments where you yes. just look at each other and say yes. Yes, uh, uh, that's when we have fun. Yeah, that's when we, <laughs> have, we really have fun. It's true. Yeah. yeah but, no, no, it's, it's just that. that I, I, that's what I was hoping, you know, we would, you know, just have a brief conversation 